Lane Keeping Assistance is a collision intervention system. It provides steering support to assist the driver in keeping the vehicle in the lane. The system reacts only when the vehicle approaches or crosses a lane line or road edge. Where is the cameras located on this vehicle and what is their function? So on this vehicle, the camera is in the front windshield right here. And what that camera is looking for is it's looking for the, the lines on the road. And it's using those lines as a reference to keep the vehicle from crossing those lines and keep them in between the lines while driving. So this car requires a dynamic calibration, which is dry when the, the person calibrating the car mm -hmm. takes it out for a drive. And OEM vehicle um, requirements, recommendations, um, have very firm specifics on how to achieve that. It can be the speed, um, the distance you drive, right? All right. of these things. What are some of the conditions that can affect that calibration? So a number of conditions can affect the calibration. Um, first of all, just talking about the glass itself. You know, we, we, we need to be using OEM glass. The OEM glass is, is, is made for the vehicle. It's got specific frit around it that is not gonna cover the camera and um, the clarity of it is, is optimal for that camera to work properly. Other conditions are uh, the conditions of the driving, right? Is, is it snowing outside? Is it raining outside? Are the lines on the road faded? Are they covered by dirt or salt or whatever the case may be? So there are certain circumstances where doing that calibration could be hard just based on the weather outside and the car could have to sit for a number of days or even a number of weeks just uh, waiting for that to be better. So as a repair shop, we often have to go in and like remove the headliner or, or mm -hmm. access the bracket um, that mounts to the windshield or R&I the windshield for some reason right. or replace it. What are some repair considerations that we as shops should be considering? So a lot of OEM service information is, is recommending or saying that the camera lens can't be touched, um, it can't be cleaned. If the part, the camera itself is dropped, you can't use it. So we have to be very careful when we're handling that, that camera and, 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 and the way that we're even just setting it to the side um, or putting it back when we're mounting it back in position. A lot of different things could affect the way that that operates. Very good information, thank you. If you found today's tip helpful, please hit the thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and share the video. Comment below for any future suggestions. These videos are made possible by SCRS. If you aren't currently a member, I encourage you to join. Visit scrs.com or use the link in the description below.